I'm Officer Reese, uh, Brandon Michael Reese, the Wilmington Police Department, and I am the assigned pa uh, Police Athletic League Coordinator, or what we call POW Hoops during basketball season. These kids have been playing basketball for the last three months, getting ready, and they've been playing in their own league, just in-house, where all the guys have been divided up. Well, we took our kids that had the best attitudes, the best abilities, the best skills, and that worked the hardest. We said, hey, all right, here's a reward for you, for you top 10. The cool thing about this is it's actually two boys and girls clubs from each side of town. We invited the Brigade Boys and Girls Club to come play, play for the championship against us. So we actually started out with a press conference before the game and we took our, our I gotta say our leaders on the team, the ones that have really set the examples for the other kids. And the coolest part was is they actually came out and said that the interaction with the coaches, uh, who are all police officers that volunteer their time to come out, but their interaction with UNCW Officer Grady and WPD Officer uh, Carlos Lamberti, that was kind of the thing that came across in the pe press conference is what had them the most excited. started out the game with just a, just a huge intro and we brought these kids out one by one calling their names and giving them giving their position and these kids came out to cheerleaders and smoke and music and it was fantastic. We called it the first annual for a reason because we want this to be something that sticks around. We want it to be something that happens every year and if we can make this event annual and make it a big deal every time and we can turn down the lights and have the laser lights going and have the smoke out there, how exciting is that for a 10, 11 or 12 year old, you know? coaches are the motivating factor in this because they're volunteer police officers. They're the same police officers that they see on the street every day. So when you come in and you take the uniform off and you look at that kid and go, I'm here for you now. You tell me what you need because we've got a goal together now. Basketball is our goal together, but now we're working together. And it starts and it builds that relationship that we want to see on the street.